have the son, Caitlin says, well, Dad, you know, um, my, my PSP is wiped out. Right. And I, I looked, and I'm like, yeah, okay, you know, well, whatever. You know, she was kind of upset because she lost her saved games, and she kept telling me that there was pornography on her on her, on her thing. And I, I'm like, oh, okay, you know, I, I she she plays this game that is um, uh, Grand Theft Auto, and I just assumed that it was coming from the game or something like that. Well, you know, after Matt had left, and she felt more, because see, when the predator's in your house, your, your children aren't going to say anything, right. because they're afraid of repercussion. I mean, uh, Matt already told my daughter that he was going to whip her arms off, you know, and uh, shove them up her butt, or throw them in the ocean, or, you know, I mean, you don't say that stuff to, to a minor. Yeah. When um, he had left and stuff, I had said, well, honey, why don't you bring me all your stuff that you got for your PSP. I went through all those SIM cards, and lo and behold, one of them had uh, pornography on it. And, and I had to delete a lot of that stuff. And I had to, actually, I just wiped out all of her cards. She had to, she lost all of her information. Yeah. But see, he tried to cover his tracks and go back in there. Can I prove it? Well, I should have had put it on there. Yeah. And she can't get on the internet with the thing. And he was the only one that was messing with her stuff. So, yeah. You know, I mean, I'd love to have the police talk to him about that and uh, get a hold of his laptop and see what else he's got on there. Right. You know, so it's just, these, these are things that he's gone. Uh, I wasn't aware of it while he was here until after he had left. So I can guarantee you I will never have anybody stay at my house ever again. Yeah. Especially somebody who claims to be a... Uh, child advocate or whatever that they claims to be. So, I mean, these, these are things that he can deny it. You know, whatever. It, it's burden of proof. I, I wiped it off. I took care of it. And um, my, my daughter was sensible enough not to look at that stuff. And he thought by taking her SIM card and wiping it out that he would uh, he would clear it out and cover his tracks. But it didn't because she had several cards. And the one that he had grabbed the wiped out was the card that he put that stuff on. So, you know, um, he's into heavy pirating and things that he does on his computer. But, you know, Mark, we can go on and on about what the guy did. The thing is, is what we need to do now is just clear him out of the country. Right. And, and move on with our life. So right. that's um, that's something that hopefully uh, people will listen to this uh, program and they'll finally open their eyes and realize. We're going to roll puzzles up okay. today. We'll have it up tonight. We'll have it out of Matt's, Matt's words. It's bad news. But believe me, we'll have, we will have we we will have this video up. You'll see it tonight, and no problem there. I'll send you everything we have. We got we'll put this in different segments of video, so we'll def definitely have it available for anybody you want to look at it and understand understand that these people are out there on cyberspace because there's lots of cases, just like Matt Ferguson. There's lots of them out there. You know, Matt Ferguson. I should say there's lots of them out there uh, that that are just doing exactly what they're doing right now being freeloaders being immigrants in this country and stealing from stealing from the hearts of American hard-working people and that's that's is right. that's his evilness I don't care well, I don't care what anybody I, else I'd is. Like to, I'd like to interview a lot of other stuff uh, amongst on his 